Hi everyone, I hope you're having a great day. If you're new to my channel, I'm Iris and I've been working as a software engineer for the past two years. I've gotten a lot of questions about my work equipment, so today is gonna be a what's in my work backpack video. I've added the links to where you can get the products in the description box below in case you wanna go check them out yourself. The first item is my backpack. This was actually a present I bought for myself last Christmas. The backpack I used before was very bulky and I never really liked the color. I just bought it because I desperately needed a work bag. So then this time I decided I wanted a backpack that is a little bit more lightweight, a bit more aesthetically pleasing and at the same time protecting my laptop. I like this one because it has a sleeve for my MacBook, it has a bunch of different pockets that help me keep my backpack organized, which is very important. And it has a hidden compartment in the back where I can store my wallet and keys without having to worry about them getting stolen. The second item, also the most important one, is my laptop. I am using a MacBook Pro M1 Max, and this is actually the first MacBook I own. Before that, I was using laptops with Windows as operating system, but then I got this MacBook from the company I'm working at now. I got it when I started with them, and I absolutely love it. It's super fast, very reliable, and has never crashed on me so far. Number three, my noise cancelling headphones. I only bought these a couple months ago and I'm so grateful to have found them because they are my lifesaver. I have no idea how I managed to work without these for so long. I'm very sensitive to noise in general, so it can be hard for me to focus if people are talking around me or if there's construction noise going on. And what I used to do before was just put on regular headphones and turn on music. I had also never tried noise cancelling headphones until recently. And I'm not kidding, the day I bought them, I put them on and I did not take them off until I went to sleep because everything around me suddenly sounded so much more peaceful. So yeah, definitely my favorite gadget. I also travel a lot and wearing these on a plane is a whole different experience. To improve my posture and avoid always looking down on my laptop, the fourth item I carry in my work backpack is this laptop stand. To be completely honest, there are probably better quality ones out there, but this one was inexpensive, it's foldable, which is a big plus for me, and it gets the job done and that's all I need. I got it off Amazon for a couple bucks and I'm super happy with it. The next item I have in my work backpack is my passport. I actually work from all over the world, and so my work backpack is also my carry-on. The company I work for is fully remote, which allows me to work while traveling. And in the past year, I've spent a lot of time in Spain, Switzerland, Mexico, and South Africa. If that is something you'd like to hear more about, go check out my other videos. Number six, and this is probably the most underrated one, I always carry this notebook with me. I often get stuck while coding or when planning how to implement a new feature. And even though searching for solutions on the internet can be super helpful, it doesn't work well for all situations. So if I get stuck while conceptualizing or trying to get a note out of my brain, the process of physically writing down my problems helps me look at them from a completely different angle. This is such a different approach because it requires you to dig deeper and get a more profound understanding of the problem you have at hand. I highly recommend you give this a try. The next item is my e-reader. I always carry my Kindle in my work backpack. There was even a time we had this developer book club going on and me and another coworker would read a book on programming at the same time and then met up to talk about it every other week. If you have any book recommendations, leave them in the comments below. I'm curious to hear if reading books about coding is something you guys do as well. And that's a wrap. These are all my essentials I carry with me in my work backpack. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I really hope you enjoyed this video and see you soon. Bye!